Good afternoon everybody, Evie here from Tasmania in Australia. Um, I didn't get a chance to do the Lazy Susan yesterday so I thought I'd do it today. I'm using exactly the same colours in the Fluoro La Res Expressions, the same, the same resin, ultra clear apparency, fast curing and I'm all ready to go. It won't take me long. I know yesterday's film was very long. So I've just cleaned off the Lazy Susan with some isocol alcohol, um, just to make sure that there's no dust or grease from my fingers or anything on it. So we're gonna start off. All the details are in the previous video, number 151, if you want to see the combinations and what colours and how I've mixed them. So we're going to start off with sunflower. We're having another glorious sunny day today, which is wonderful. This Lazy Susan has got a rim, so I'm trying to just keep it to the rim. So I don't have to put the um, uh, tape around it. Next, we're going to have the fluoro orange. Or oh, hang on, do I do the? I'll do it. A little line with the angel white. And we've got the fluoro orange. It is level, but I'm just going to top it up a little there. Next one's the pink after a line of angel white. Normally I'd start from off the board, but I don't want to actually gunk up the outside. So I'm trying to keep it as clean as I can as I go, because I don't want any colour on the top. I will glaze the top here. This is the fluoro pink. And then we're going to have the purple and then the blue. These actually glow, really glow if you put them under a black light too, which is quite fun for a party. So far, so good. Just, I have leveled this up, but um, I'm just going to, you can see it's running down this way, so obviously it's not quite level. Oh dear, very frustrating. It can only just be the most tiniest amount. Hopefully. That's a bit better. Now the last one I'm going to put on here is the fluoro 
blue. little bit more. I think that should do it. moving again <laughs> hopefully I might have it level now hope you can see that oh yes you can that's good great I'm now going to remove some of the bubbles they do come to the surface roll go across the white because it will create some nice effect pushing the white along oh that's quite pretty isn't it I think I need some white down here I might just put some white here I made the angel white up first so that it could thicken slightly. Yesterday it was so runny. Just need a little touch more blue here. go over I can see a hair on there actually that I'm going to remove I'll just get a, a saute stick sort of bend down and put your eye along where was that or oh, here there we are look at that one of mine obviously did I see another Oh yes, another one here. That's oh did I drop it? Okay. So once again I'm going to push that white. And I'm gonna do it again. can hear a noise that's my my puppy dogs They're not supposed to be in here but they, I've left the door open <laughs> okay and again Turn that off for a moment. Here we are. So that you can see what I've done here. It's sort of made like it creates cells when you blow torch the angel white, and it's sort of made like a rainbow sea. I may put a bit more white in. Okay, I've blown out some more white. I've wiped up the edges. You can see if I zoom in What's happening with the angel white isn't it beautiful and there were a couple of hairs in there that I've managed to get out so of mine I think I'll have to wear a hairnet when I do this 
Anyway, so that's my beautiful um, Lazy Susan. So we'll come back and um, see that later. So I'm making another, well that's not zooming in very well, is it? Um, bowl, more beads, and I'm halfway filling up a diamond. Here we are. Is the uh, Lazy Susan completed? Thrilled to bits with it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you. One beautiful, beautiful Lazy Susan. One beautiful, beautiful Lazy Susan.